Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel Health Ignite Fitness. This is a dumbbell upper body workout. We will be doing a warm up of about 4 minutes followed by 5 exercises of 3 sets each and a cool down of 5 minutes. Make sure you are not diminishing your form by using a weight that is too heavy. Modify where you have to and take, take breaks where you need to. Let's get started with the warm up. The first exercise is going to be lateral and ventral raises for 12 reps. Stand hip, stand with your feet hip width apart with a slight bend in your knee. You need to engage your shoulders as you extend to the side, the front and when you lower them back down. Make sure not to extend your arm above or your wrist and your weight above shoulder height. And you need to feel the mind-body connection with your entire shoulder muscle. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. You 
You can start your second set now. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. This is your third set. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. The second exercise is going to be a row combination. You're going to be doing 12 reps. You need to extend your glutes backwards like you're about to sit on a chair and then lower your back down until it is straight. You need to make sure to engage your back muscles and squeeze the shoulder blades together. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. You can start your second set now.
you can rest for 30 to 60 seconds just pause the video when you have to This is your third set. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. The third exercise is going to be bicep curl combination. You're going to be doing 12 reps. You're going to stand with your feet hip width apart with a slight bend in the knee. You need to make sure that you have a good grip on the weight because that engages your forearm muscles as well. You need to keep your elbows close to your sides and you need to remember to engage your muscle, your bicep muscle as you do the movement. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. You can start your second set now.
you can rest for 30 to 60 seconds just pause the video when you have to This is your third set. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds. Just pause the video when you have to. The fourth exercise is going to be tricep kickbacks and you're going to be doing 15 reps per side. This exercise can be done on the floor. Remember to keep your back flat. Make sure to keep your elbow close to your side. The only movement that is taking place is at the elbow, which is extending, extending your arm backwards. You need to keep a good grip on the weight and you need to remember to engage your triceps as you are lifting up the weight. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. You can start your second set now.
you can rest for 30 to 60 seconds just pause the video when you have to This is your third set. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. The fifth exercise is going to be rows. You're going to be doing 15 per side. You need to remember to keep your back flat. This exercise can be done on the floor. And also remember to keep your elbow close to your body when you're busy doing the row. Do not twist, twist your upper body too much while you're busy doing the row and keep your shoulders flat and straight. Engage your upper side of your back where the weight is lifted which is your latissimus dorsi muscle. This needs to be engaged while you're busy doing the exercise. You can rest for 30 to 60 seconds, just pause the video when you have to. You can start your second set now.
you can rest for 30 to 60 seconds just pause the video when you have to This is your third set. We are done and you can follow me for the cool down. Train, train. 